hey there, come on in out of, this, out of the snow and let me show you this house. We're at 7515 Isabel Circle. This house is priced at 625. We're in the main floor here and right off the door is a formal room to be a study or it could be a formal living room. Followed by the dining room that has coffered ceilings and lots of windows. As we step back into the house, we'll go into the kitchen and you'll see that we have brand new Whirlpool appliances. We've got stained maple cabinets and slab granite countertops. Lots of wood floors throughout this property. We've got the breakfast nook and next to the breakfast nook is a nice big pantry. So right on over, we're gonna go to the formal living room or the great room. So the great room's got lots of views and windows. You can't really tell because it's snowing sideways right now, but across the street is a park that has lots of trails and a pond. Directly behind this property is a canal and those trees in the summer make it so that you don't even see your neighbors behind. Obviously a nice gas fireplace with lots of art niches as we go through. Going down to the basement, the basement is unfinished in this house, but I like how open it is and has kind of a interesting stairway. The door is down at the bottom of the stairs, so you just don't, it feels more open. Going into the master bedroom, the master bedroom has the hardwood floors and it's got on the right side of the house with the views outside and then into the bathroom that has granite countertops here, tile floor, and it's got a huge closet. From here, we're gonna go right across the hallway and into the hallway, we'll go to the guest room. So the guest room is ample size for a queen size bed and it does have a private ensuite bathroom that has a tub shower combo. We're just gonna walk the other direction and go back to near the front door where you will see the laundry room and the garage. The garage is two and a half bays. It's got plenty of room for a workbench there's a half bath here, and then we've got the laundry room. Laundry room's got a lot of counter or a lot of cabinets. So that's it. If you would like more information on this house, you can give us a call or email us. Otherwise, thank you for joining me today.